Hey guys, how's it going? It's Chris. Today we're going to be showing you how I go about editing my covers. So this is the current Audacity file for Fuels the Comedy. And it's uh, pretty segmented up. But we're, what we're going to do first of all, we're going to select everything. We're going to go into effects and we're going to add this custom equalization. It's going to get rid of just like a, a tiny bit of stuff that we don't need. Some dregs of garbage. Next what we're going to do is we're going to go to the beginning of the timeline. Oops. And we're going to grab a small section. We're going to grab the section right here where we can hear the music a little bit. And we're going to do noise reduction, get noise profile. Then we're going to select everything, go back into noise reduction. And then with these settings, we're going to apply that, which should cut down a lot of the uh, background noise. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a little bit of uh, bass and treble. And then I'm going to go into normalize, try to average out the uh, the peaks, and that should be about it. We're going to go ahead and export it as an MP3, and then hit save just in case we need to go back into that. Go ahead and add the instrumental and the actual song, and then we're going to align these wavelengths. So that way they're at the same time. Sometimes I like to uh, group these together so I can drag them at the same time. Go ahead and trim some of that, make that even. Then we're going to reduce the volume of that down to zero so it's not in the way. And then drop in our actual uh, vocal cover section. And then what we can do is first off, whoops. First off, I'm going to go add an audio effect. We're going to add a reverb to the actual file itself. This will be used for our chorus. So initially we're gonna have that turned off, but I'm going to use, I think medium room with a bigger room size, a little bit less, but a tiny bit more of the reverb. We'll see how that sounds later. And then I'm gonna add, grab the actual timeline effect. We're going to do a uh, compression at negative 12. We're going to cut out hiss, drop that down a little bit more and then go in here, equalization, reverb, and a tiny bit of smooth. We're gonna do one smooth, so it just kind of cleans up a little bit. Nothing crazy, it's not like auto-tune or anything, it just cleans up the audio a tiny bit. It just makes it a little bit a little bit more smooth. And then I like to use warm space for most of my covers. It, it, um, it doesn't add a lot of tinniness. A lot of these um, different room presets add a lot of tinniness to it, which I don't like. And then for this song in particular, we're going to add a little bit of bass. We're going to keep the treble up, but we're going to drop the mid down just a tiny bit. So now what we have to do is find out where the actual vocals come in. Oh, that sounded really funny. All right, so right there is where that starts. And this is where I start. And we're going to try to line that. Drop this down a little bit so I can hear. Oh my God, I'm feeling crazy, man. Walk on the bass as I walk into this place. All right, that sounds like it's pretty lined up. Then we're going to duplicate, duplicate, and I think I only did three recordings of this. Uh, yeah, three. So we only need a few of those. So then delete these, go to the end of the song, cut. Here's take two, go to the end of the song, cut, trim, and here's take three. And we're going to take this, align it a little bit try to get those waves perfectly lined up or as perfect as we can some of these look like i had a bit of a longer drag on them so that's okay pacing was a little bit off in some places which is fine we'll like realign some of these so now that we got those lined up oh my god i'm feeling crazy man that's with everything playing at once i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to drop the output a little bit on each of these so it's not hard blasting so much because as you can see let's go ahead and solo play this oh my god i'm feeling crazy man walk on it be as i walk and chill this place every I'm, I'm peeking on the output a little bit on that one let's go in here oh my god i'm feeling crazy man what could it be that one's a little bit better and then we're gonna do the same for this oh my god this is crazy <laughs> All right, that one I messed up on the uh, intro a little bit, so we can cut that. Crazy man, what could it be? Taking that one a little bit easier, so 
it's not so harsh. <clears throat> All right. Next, what I'm going to do, since I already aligned up the audios, we can mute the actual track and just keep the instrumental in my take right here. See how this, because sometimes the instrumentals are a little bit quieter. Oh my God, I'm feeling crazy, man. Walk on his face as I walk into this place. Everyone's staring at me. So for each section, I like to cut those so I can edit each section at a time. I can balance audio for each one at a time. So now I'm feeling God, I'm fucked up to see. Cause I got to see the biggest God that's boarding at me. Do I make you laugh? That one seems to be going okay. Are you I am going to increase my mic volume a little bit because I know I'm probably talking kind of quiet for this. What was the hostility? Why is it so So that's the whole chorus, and cut each section. It's a lot of this tedious, just prep shit. Okay. Bup, bup. And now what we can do is for the chorus sections, we can turn on that additional reverb to give each one of those choruses a little bit more depth. Reverb, reverb, oop, reverb, and reverb. And then I can modify all those later. So let's go section by section. Oh my God, I'm feeling crazy, man. Walk on his face as I walk into this place. Everyone's staring at me. So I like that one, so this one's going to be, so far, the dominant one. I'm going to drop it a little bit, so it's not so bold. Let's listen to the second one. Oh my god, I'm feeling crazy, man! What could it be? As I walk into this place, everyone's staring at me! That one's decent, but not as good. And then this one, I don't have any high hopes for. Crazy man, what could it be? As I walk into this place, everyone's staring at me! That one's more of an accent to take, so we're going to drop that down a little bit lower. I'm gonna try to match these a little bit and then listen to them all at the same time. Oh my god, I'm feeling crazy, man! What could it be? As I walk into this place, everyone's staring at me! Oh my god! Alright. So that's not bad. I'm feeling crazy, man! What could it be? As I walk into this place, everyone's staring at me! Not bad. Alright. Listen to this so section again. Looks like this first one was a pretty good take overall. So now I feel like I'm a fuck of disease, cause I got to see the biggest god that's boring at night. So now I feel like I'm a fuck of disease, cause I got to see the biggest god that's boring at night. So now I feel like I'm a fuck of disease. You seem like they're a little bit not aligned. Let's try to drag those back a little bit. So now I feel like I'm a fuck of disease, cause I got to see the I think for this bottom one, I'm going to drop the treble a little bit, bring the mid up, give it a little bit extra bass, and then we're going to reduce that liveliness a little bit. Not sure about that one yet. I didn't like this intro right there. I came in a little bit soft. I 
want to keep the dick nice and hard. Just dick. dick. All three of them are going to be max out for dick. All right. Uh, drop that one a teeny bit. Do I make you laugh? Do you think I'm funny? Ah, the funny queer shit. Get out of here. Let me make myself clear. I don't give a fuck. All you people can suck my motherfucking dick. What's with the hostility? Let me make myself clear. I don't give a fuck. All you people can suck my motherfucking dick. Sounds like those are a little bit missed timing there we go that's better all right now for the chorus this one is where it can get a little bit messy because they all have additional reverb so i have to balance this pretty well and there's a lot of uh, it's a long take so i might have to like cut some sections to like drop this even though this was better or whatever but we'll see as we go what was the hostility why is it so Didn't like the intro that much. Definitely didn't like that. The bottom one's the best take. All right. The good thing is about uh, the chorus is like the chorus is a lot louder, so it's also nice to have all three takes be louder volume, so they can kind of crowd it a little bit. What was the hostility? Why is it so provoked? Alright, not bad. We'll go back later. Oh my god, the shit is crazy, man. Look at the scene as I watch these stupid people act like they are machines. Mm, the only thing I don't like about that is. It's a little bit, hey, it's got like a real nasality to it, so. Oh my God, the shit is crazy, man. Look at like that man. See, that's like what? These stupid people act like they are machines. It's not bad, though. Oh my God, the shit is crazy, man. Look at the scene. That's like what? These stupid people act like they are machines. Oh my God, the shit is crazy, man. Look at the scene. That's like what? These stupid people. Yeah, I'm definitely taking all those verses much softer. Oh my god, the shit is crazy, man. Look at the scene. That's like what? These stupid people act like they are machines. They should really all drop to their knees. Drop the jealousy. That's the one thing I guarantee. They should really all drop to their knees. Drop the jealousy. I didn't take this one as harsh because this, you know, these are all going in one take. So it's definitely had some sections of just running out of breath for some songs, especially for shorter songs. And I didn't have a lot of time when I was actually recording these. I recorded this one and Lost in the Grander back to back. So uh, I didn't have a lot of time to record them. So I was just doing three one takes instead of doing a bunch of like section at a time, 10 times per like verse per section. I just busted them all out. So I definitely had moments of like my voice failing or 
losing my breath or whatever. They should really all drop to the knees of the jealousy. That's the one thing I guarantee. Okay. You will make you laugh. So you think I'm funny, you ha! Comes a little too harsh after this. Make sure that reverb is turned on. It is okay. That was real nasally. That was real nasally. save you guys from hearing some of those bad black takes. I'm just gonna take these two. Alright, now for this, since we actually have uh, some distortion in it, what I'm gonna do is add its own equalization. And then... I wish I had... I don't think I have that effect. Fuck, what was the name of it? It wasn't flange. 
Oh, man, I can't remember what it was called. Basically, it was uh, where the audio bounces left and right between the ears. I don't think it's in here. I have it on Audacity, but what I'm going to do for this section, each one of them is going to have their own unique equalization, and then I might even take one of them. I know I muffled my voice for one of them. Because uh, it starts with like a muffled sound. What's with the hostility? Why is it so provoked? You're living in a fantasy past I think we are gonna have a little bit of a fade in. And then... Did I not just add the equalization? Fine. Gonna up that. With the hostility? Why is it so provoked? You're living in a... Yeah, that one I like cupped my mouth when doing it. So we're gonna bring that mid up, bring the bass up. Little little treble. Oops. Why is it so proud? That one's gonna be the treble one. I'm actually gonna have this one have a little bit extra reverb too. I'm gonna give it a plate reverb, but with original. And then once we get out of that section, we're gonna make it normal again. Because then it's going into the actual chorus. So let's hear all those at the same time. What's with the hostility? Why is it so provoked? Drop those a little bit. Hostility, why is it so provoked? Why is it so provoked? You're living in a fantasy past how you go. Go ahead, pick the shit out of me. It just feels like the truth. So looks like that seems all right. Let's go ahead and give it a once through from the beginning just for this video. And then at the end of this, I have, I'll uh, skip that part. Why is it so provoked? You're living in a fantasy 
So that was the first pass through, and there's really, I don't have a lot of notes. The only thing I don't like that much is the ending chorus. Uh, I was definitely you know losing steam for all those. So what I might possibly do is you know take copy of one of the choruses here, throw it at the end, just to add. So like, Go ahead, take like we'll take this one because this is the loudest, so it's probably the best. Go. So then we'll take. Uh, this cut that insert this here realign it go ahead get the shit out of me it just feels Not bad, not bad. Um, so that's what I'm going to do for this video. I do have one more surprise for you guys. I actually have a raw recording take from my phone. I'm going to insert after this so you guys can see kind of like how I am when I'm recording it. Um, it's completely unedited. It's just from my phone, so it's not going to sound that great. There's no music. You can kind of hear the music coming through my headphones a little bit, but just, you know, whatever. A little, little bonus, I guess. And... Um, by the time this full cover comes out, there might be some slight tweaks. I might do like a low take on my microphone, just to add a little bit more deeper tonality to it. But otherwise, this is the 75% finished cover. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the process of that. And um, yeah, check out this clip. God, I'm feeling crazy, man. What could it be? As I walk into this place, everyone's staring at me. So now I feel like I'm a fucked up disease. Cause I've got to see fingers got they're pointing at me. Do I make you laugh? Do you think I'm funny? Ya ha, the funny queer shit. Get out of here. Let me make myself clear. I don't give a fuck. All you people can suck my motherfucking dick. What's with the hostility? Why is it so provoked? You're living in a fantasy, that's how you cope. Go ahead, kick the shit out of me. It just feels a comedy. Feel it's your superior, I feel you just plain absurd. Ridiculous vanity, that is blurred. Go ahead, kick the shit out of me. It just feels the comedy. Oh my god, this shit is crazy, man. Look at the scene as I watch these stupid people act like they are machines. They should really all drop to the knees of the jealousy. That's the one thing I guarantee. 
do I make you laugh? Do you think I'm funny? Ah, uh -huh, the funny queer shit. Get out of here. Let me make myself clear. I don't give a fuck. All you people can suck my motherfucking dick. What's with the hostility? Why is it so provoked? You're living in a fantasy. That's how you cope. Go ahead, kick the shit out of me. It just feels a comedy. Feel it, you're superior. I feel you just plain absurd. Ridiculous vanity that is blurred. Go ahead, kick the shit out of me. It just feels the comedy. No! Watch the hostility, why is it so provoked? You're living in a fantasy, that's how you cope. Go ahead, kick the shit out of me. It just feels the comedy. Feel it your superior, I feel you just plain absurd. Ridiculous vanity, that is blurred. Go ahead, kick the shit out of me. It just feels the comedy.